Hello everybody and welcome to another episode. I just thought I'd let you guys see that my Brazilian red and white knee just molted not too long ago. I should have really taken this while she was molting. Here are a few tips that you should keep in mind about a molting spider. First of all, you will know when your spider is molting because tarantulas actually flip right over onto their back when they're molting. Now, if you see this, don't freak out. Your spider isn't dying. It's not dead. It's just molting. And whatever you do, never try and flip it back over onto the right side. It will definitely kill the spider. Also, too, after the spider molts, some spiders really like to stay near their skins for a couple of days while they're recouping. Now, the older the spider, the harder it is on it to recover from a molt. So, you usually know when your spider is well on its way to recovery, when it sort of pushes its skin off to the side, starts moving around a little bit, um, then you can maybe try and offer it a cricket. Now, what I like to do with this guy is she is a larger spider. So, when I see that she's pushed her skin over to the side like this, I try and give her a cricket. When I see that she's eating the crickets and I know that she's well, well, um, I gave this guy a pinky. Now, I know some people don't like that or whatever, but I like to give my larger spiders pinkies after they molt because it has a lot of goodness and nutrients in it to help them recoup. So, after I see that she's eating a crickets, I gave her a pinky and she ate it. So, she's well on her way to doing, for, you know, recovering. But like I said, remember, never bother a spider when it's molting. Even spray in the cage while it's molting on its back. Just leave it alone. Don't bother it. Um, after it's molted and you see that it's like sitting on its skin or around its skin, still don't spray in the cage. Just leave it alone. You know when it's well on its way, when it moves the skin out to the side and starts moving around a bit. Well, I hope this was helpful, um, and I hope you have good luck with your molting spiders. Stay tuned for some more. Bye for now.